Good morning everybody, this is Kevin. Yesterday my son and I were out wandering around alongside a country road and we uh, found a large mound of dirt that had all this chert on top of it. So we loaded our pockets down and brought some home. I thought that would give me a good opportunity this morning to do the uh, elective for flint and steel and char cloth. So I'm going to, what I have here is I have some uh, cotton flannel pajama bottoms that I've cut up. Um, this piece here has still got the seam. It's kind of doubled up. I don't think it'll hurt anything. I'll try it out, see how it works. Got my Altoids can here, or tin, excuse me, with the small hole there. Simple striker. So I'm going to take this, put it in my Altoids tin. Fire's right behind us here. It's burned down the coal, so I'll switch the camera and get back to you. Okay, I got my tin here. I'm going to set it right here on the coals and wait for it to start smoking. It shouldn't take too long. Okay, hopefully you can see there it's starting to smoke through the hole there. It's also coming out of the hinges in the back here. So I'll just sit here and wait for it to stop smoking and I'll talk to you then. Just wanted to show you again real quick. It's smoking pretty good now. Hopefully you can see it a little better there. Shouldn't be too long now. Okay, so it's done smoking. It's actually been done for a little while, but the neighbor was blowing leaves with his leaf blower, so it was a little too noisy out here to record. I'll leave this off to the side here, let it cool down for a few minutes, and I'll talk to you when it's cool. Okay, so everything's cooled down. Let's see what we got here. I don't know if you can see in there or not. Turned out pretty good, it looks like. Got it on the third strike. There we go. This is Kevin. That was my elective on char cloth and flint and steel. Sorry about the leaf blower. Thanks for watching.